Good afternoon. This is Kathleen Pate at My Alabama Farm Life. Today I am building and adding two deep boxes and frames to my beehives. Last week I checked on my hives to see how busy my bees have been and discovered that they were running out of room and it was time to expand the hive as soon as possible. At this point I had decided how much time did I feel I had to make the addition and how much money I was willing to spend. I could order another full hive from Hoover Hives, but when I looked at the shipping estimation times, I decided that that was really too much time that I'd be waiting around just for the hive to ship. My bees are very busy. Everything is in bloom right now. I've got roses and honeysuckle, and I just noticed that the privet hedges are starting to bloom. I do not want to miss out on any honey that my bees could make right now. So I made the decision to go to my local hive supply store in Birmingham. So Saturday morning, Eleanor and I drove to Foxhound Bee Supply and we purchased two unfinished 10 deep boxes and 20 deep frames. Now it's time to get these boxes and frames put together and added to my hives. I decided that once I had the boxes ready, I would stall them first thing in the morning, which would have been fine if the temperature wasn't already 65 degrees at 7 a.m. And being a confessed firebug, I do not know why I refused to learn how to use my smoker, but I chose not to. I probably would have helped a lot in this situation as I was stung a few times, even through my gloves and my clothing. At this point, I decided to start with the hive with the least activity. I wanted to put the new boxes on the bottom and was almost unable to do so because of the weight of the box. It was pretty heavy, but I did succeed, barely. The second hive was too heavy for me to lift and the bees were getting really aggressive so I decided speed would be my best friend installing this next box.
Well, I got bit a couple of times, I, but I got it done. Um, I've got my two deeps on my hives. I really wanted that, um, the one of that, that I ended up leaving on top. I really wanted it on the bottom, but that box is so heavy, which is really exciting because if it's that heavy, it's got honey in it. But I'm not going to mess with it. They'll figure it out. They were already building up into the top frame or that top piece that covers there on the top. They had already been building up. It had uh, wax all over it. So I know that in no time they're going to be building up into that deep. Now the other one um, wasn't as heavy. And actually that originally was my uh, docile. No. That originally was my wild hive, and uh, they didn't have any honey when I put them in, but the other one did. So um, they were still really active, but they are nowhere near as wild as what they were when I first put them in. It's my dice docile. It's my docile hive that is just off the chain. So, oh my goodness, I thought I got up early enough, but I didn't. They were just wild. But I got it done, and uh, I've got both my deeps. Hopefully, that will fix the bearding problem that I'm having. And it's also the 1st of May, and I'm hoping that maybe if there is any swarms out here of wild bees, I'll be able to catch them. But that'll be another video. So, you guys have a great day, and be blessed.